Right now I'm on the campus of Bryn Mawr College, which is in suburban Philadelphia, not too far from Haverford College. Um, as I walk around here in the, in the dying light of a beautiful spring day, I think, how come the girls get all the pretty campuses? I mean, this is absolutely gorgeous. And Smith, Mount Holyoke, I mean, come on, why do, why do the girls get all the pretty campuses? Um, but it does, when you come to visit a place like this, that's an all-women's school, um, it does make you reflect on what is a, a women's education. Um, I used to teach at an all-girls school, a secondary school, and I can tell you from experience that I think that there really is room um, for uh, an all-women's education. The opportunities that women have here, that it, you, you see some of the very inspirational um, sayings and phrases that are used in, in their um, marketing materials, but also just in the walls of the student center. I mean, it's a very inspiring place for young women, and um, it does eliminate by not having men on the same campus. It does eliminate some of the distractions. It also eliminates or, or creates opportunities for women to exert their leadership and to um, not compete, as it were, with with one half of the species. So. Um, I think that there's some really great reasons why women should consider a uh, college like Bryn Mawr. And really you're not that far away from um, the company of men, should that be one of the goals of your college education. Uh, Haverford College, which used to be kind of a paired college with Bryn Mawr, still is. Um, their campus newspaper is shared and many of their activities, and they call it the, the bi-college um, arrangement, there are plenty of opportunities for uh, mixing academically and socially with men on the Haverford campus. Haverford is, is uh, co-ed, there are both genders on the campus, but again, if you, you want the company of men, you can certainly find it at Haverford, and Swarthmore is not that far away, and heck, uh, you're here to study, so maybe, uh, maybe that is not your main priority if you're looking for a, a college campus. So, Check out those women's schools, and uh, for those of you who are women and, and men, you'll just have to visit these campuses and look around and think, wow, this is really nice.